Hola amigos. Heavy air checking in for a hum of the earth. Just spent the equivalent of a day in uh, Mazunte. Really liked it, really chill vibe. A uh, great place to just sit on the beach or walk around, have a drink and eat. Uh, but, gotta move on. Um, so today, I hope you're ready for uh, a beach day. I'll be going to Zipolite in Puerto Angel on my bicycle and uh, checking out the uh, beaches in between. This rock here is visible from Mazunte. So as you can see, Zipolite not very far at all. Definitely worth a little a little trip. Nice and breezy. Kind of the same beach as Zipolite. Playa Panteon. I wasn't sure if this was going to be worth it because I had to go all the way back down the hill I just climbed. But uh, it's pretty unique. Definitely the most visually uh, unique and stunning of uh, the beaches I've seen so far today. Let's see if it can hold the crown. So I've arrived in uh, Puerto Angel. Things are starting to feel more Mexican. So Puerto Angel doesn't have too many uh, hotels. The one I went to is out of my price range. But uh, my new amigo, Fernando, <laughs> offered me a, a place to stay here. Por si vas a nadar, te los presto. Oh. Ya. Gracias. Para que veas los peces allá. Te, oh, muy este bien. Lo, lo desarma, si lo, lo arma. Ya solo te lo pones así y puedes respirar, ver los peces. Yeah, so that was my... Uh, my friend Fernando just gave me some scuba gear. Should be fun. Um, or let me rather. Uh, and yeah, so he's uh, working on this building, I guess, with his friend. And uh, he said I could stay here for the night. So, pretty sweet deal. No shower this time, but oh, but there is bats. Um, so I'm just gonna go for a dip in the ocean. First, pescado. How was it?
Amigo, ¿todo bien? <laughs> so unfortunately, uh, as it usually is, my uh, action camera with the waterproof casing, the battery was dead. Um, so, wasn't able to get any footage of uh, me snorkeling, uh, but it was an amazing experience. Uh, I got to see um, a lot of uh, different types of fish, different colors, uh, even schools of fish and stuff like that. And uh, it was actually one of the more exhilarating uh, experiences of uh, uh, my adventure so far. Uh, just because I find it kind of frightening just being in there with all the fish, you know, it's an environment that you really don't uh, know or understand and uh, with the waves and everything too, you have to hold your ground and whatnot. So uh, super awesome. So big thanks to uh, Fernando and um, yeah, so uh, where I was staying uh, that uh, kind of raggedy looking building there. Um, it's actually his friends and he's kind of watching it and staying in it and they're going to be uh, building a hotel there. Uh, so if ever you're in uh, Puerto Angel, past 2020, uh, check it out, see if it's open. Um, and uh, I can't promise that Fernando will still be there, but uh, big thanks to uh, Fernando for his uh, hospitality. And uh, yeah, just had a really awesome day. Um, uh, biking along the uh, Oaxaca coast, checking out the various beaches. Just a perfect day. And um, next, I will be heading to Santa Cruz, Huatalco. Uh, so a different uh, Huatalco than uh, where I was before, which was Santa Maria. <laughs> and uh, there's supposed to be some super awesome snorkeling there. So I'm going to make sure my camera is charged and uh, see if I can get some uh, good footage of that. So uh, I hope you enjoyed. Um, this was all part of my bicycle tour from Canada to Argentina. If you'd like to find out more, you can check out my website, followthehumoftheearth.com, and you can subscribe to my channel uh, to continue my following adventures. To continue my, to follow my continuing adventures, rather. <laughs> Alright, so uh, I gotta get biking to my next destination. Hope you liked the video. Have a good one.